Hey guys, what's going on? This is you know who, Chris, if you want to call me that. Um, you want to quickly go over to uh, where we landed last time to sort of start the 30 probe collecting for this. And um, this unlocks the concept art of the uh, barnyard. Also, a few things I got wrong. Um, it's not called the Pentagon, it's called the Octagon in my previous video, I apologize for that, I am very stupid that I've always thought that it was called the Pentagon, but as I was checking the video, I realized that, oh wait, they actually call it the Octagon, so sorry about that. Another thing, I forgot about the name of uh, Uniontown, I don't know how I forgot that because that's actually in my favorite level design. This is also my favorite level design as well. It's basically based off of Washington DC, but of course they just called it Capital City. Of course they probably would have got copyright and sued the crap out of if they ever dared called it that. But uh, no, there are of course 30 probes and yes, you unlock something called the Barnyard Concept Art. Um, I'll put the... Um, name of it in the video below the description I think I got it right I hope I got it right but um yes this will be the final probe collecting for destroy all humans 2005 of course and uh, funny enough I did this on my first try um, I didn't really have any problems Apart from tanks, tanks are always going to be a problem for me when you're on foot. Um, I think the worst thing that can happen to your sorcerer are those Tesla coils. They're um, a pain in the ass and you want to get rid of them as soon as possible. But um, as you can see I just clearly just decided to ignore them and just try and fly past them. Which, that's usually a bad, bad decision because they can take you out in about, I'd say about 5 or 6 seconds depending if you stay um well in their range for too long because they can take quite a lot of your source's health but uh yep yeah, that's probe number seven um my main concern for this mission is of course tanks i love saying tanks because they really annoy me when i'm on foot because if you get hit by one they uh, sort of stun you when you fall over and it's really annoying and you don't want to get hit. Um, there's also the bridge part. Um, it's funny, um, doing the recordings I don't ever run into any problems. It's pretty funny. Either I'm just lucky or um, the game's just being really kind to me. <laughs> And usually this game isn't kind to me. Um, so you might not have as much luck as I did uh, crossing the bridge. But um, if you do struggle, just sort of hollow bob. Um, I am getting a little ahead of myself here. Um, we're not even close to the uh, bridge part. But uh, as you can see... The probes are actually pretty well hidden in this one. Um, they are in some obvious places, but you probably obviously wouldn't look to find them. And there you go, that's the first time I got hit by a tank. And um, this level isn't as bad as Area 42. Um, I just want to say that Area 42 is a nightmare. Even if you get a majestic level on this, you should have no problem. Um, you might die once or twice. Maybe. But, um. Find out if I die in this one, of course. I'm this not gonna enemy. tell you. But, um. Once this is done, I'll try and get as many of the levels out as fast as I can. Um. Because I know this is taking a while. Um. This will be part 23. Um. I'm not going to tell you how many more parts are going to be left, but um, if you've played this game before, I'm guessing you've got a very good idea. And um, nah, 
for a first attempt at this and also the uh, lack of time I had to sort of do it, I sort of woke up. Um, oh yeah, I forgot to give a shout out to Nano4211. Um, I used his video as a reference. Um, of course, one thing I noticed in his videos, he uses cheats, um, which is fair enough. I can understand why, because of course he just wants to show people, you know. But my challenge for this was to not use any cheats for whatever reason. And um, if you like just started first playing this game, then you're probably gonna use cheats straight away because you don't have a clue what you're doing. Um, but I've always tried not to use cheats. Well, I don't ever use cheats unless I'm just doing it for fun, of course. Um, that's the way I look at it. But now, I get pretty lucky. I mean, look how close these bullets are coming to me. Of course, if you know if I'm cheating, my health won't go down. Um, my psychokinesis won't go down either if I'm in a human form or if I'm using my key PK ability where I like side like throw stuff. I'm pretty sure there's a cheat for unlimited ammo, but I I I, I actually don't know. <laughs> I don't remember what the cheats, uh, the codes for the cheats are, so when I do my extras in other video, I won't be showing them. March here, march there, march it yourself. Um, if you want to see them, you're going to have to check out a different video for that. Um, what I will be showing for my uh, extras in other video, of course, is one side mission, um, my favorite one, which I actually enjoy doing. You'll probably see in a moment when um, I go to show you the stats. I haven't done any side missions yet. Oh, and it's, look at that. They all sort of die. I don't know what happened there, but I'm guessing the uh, robot side like stomp him, and then like the tank just had a hissy fit. Oh yeah, and something really weird happens here also. Watch this. As my bar goes to go up, for some odd reason, I go back into a disguise. I don't know what why I did that, but... um. That was pretty weird. I don't know if you'll get that problem on the PS4 or PS2. Um, maybe on the Xbox. I've had a few like weird glitches going on. I am like playing this on the 360, so maybe that's why. And there's the octagon, which I, for some odd reason, always called the Pentagon. Don't ask me why. I, I'm guessing it's just like when I used to play this game as a kid. I automatically assumed that that was the uh, Pentagon. And uh, this area, yeah, all the probes for it are actually pretty close by to each other. I don't know why. I guess either they got lazy or they were just like, nah, whatever. Let's just stick them in this area because it's the most annoying area ever because there's a lot of g man um, there's no tanks in here thank god for that I would have hated that if there was just a tank there as you can see like um the background the landscape doesn't seem to load very well looks kind of weird but I'll give it the benefit of the doubt since it is a uh, 12 year old game And um, when we get these last, well, I'm guessing this probe and the last two, not the last two, sorry, um, the other two, um, the other ones will be sort of like hidden in boxes and um, the trucks. Um, I'll show you where. They, they don't move or whatever, they're always in the same spot. It's kind of funny. So for the last, I would say six probes. Maybe five. 
Okay, six more to go. And that soldier's always gonna be there. I don't know why. He just likes to look at that crate for whatever reason. He has a fascination for it. And then there's one on top of this Tesla coil. And the tank almost just hit me. And there's another one. They were all actually pretty close by in um, this octagon area. And then I do that just so I will, like, no majestic guys sort of spawned near me. Because sometimes it can be actually quite a few here. And um, the last two, one which you saw in that cutscene, uh, Mr. Crypto goes to Capital City. And the last one is literally right behind it. And there we go, all 30 pros for Capital City. I'm just gonna run over here because I know they won't actually chase me when I'm over here. So yeah. As we go into invasion report. World Overlord 91 can well 91 percent complete. And then I'm just showing you for the levels we got 100 percent There we go, all probes recovered. And there you go. Rockwell, Santa Modesta, Area 42, Uniontown, and Capital City. All done. All 184 probes. So, thank you very much if you've uh, watched this video. I'm sorry my commentary is terrible, but you know, I'm pretty bad at it. I hope you've enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.